living life every day, late at night, not okay. All I want. So right now we're driving out of Morrison, Colorado. This week we are going to bounce around to a few different um, spots in Colorado we, we want to check out. And um, it'll be our last week in Colorado before then we make our way to Yellowstone via um, Utah. And so we're going to go to Vail and then Buena Vista and then um, Crested on the way to Utah. Spending two days in Vail. Uh, we call this a master plan city. They have buses to take you to all the trailheads. The photo potties are clean. Uh, so we're really enjoying it, not just the winter town here. Yeah, all I need are some better days. Cause all I want and I pray, I believe in the better yeah. days. I'm kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place. Do I work hard or live in my pace? You're only young once. Yeah, that's all great. But I also want a future where I'm okay. Living life is doing lots of cocaine. Wait, no, it's living with no shame. Wait, no, it's sleeping in on Sundays. I guess it's different for each of us and that's okay. Well, I just want to be happy. How to get there? Hmm, glad that you asked me. I think it's different for everyone. Some of us need work, others need fun. Some of us need purpose to overcome. But try to do what you love when it's said and done. Cause there's so many differences in each of us. Trust your gut, it can show you what you want. Living life every day, night. Common theme of early season hikes in Colorado, snow. <laughs> we try to go as far as we can on each hike and then when we deem it unsafe, we'll turn around, but all the hikes have been worth it. Just hard to go to the end goal every day find a great spot to have lunch seriously check out where we are camping tonight It gets stressful sometimes in the cities when you're trying to find a place to camp and you've been driving all day and you're tired. And uh, really proud of us today. We remained calm and put our problem solving skills together to find a beautiful camp spot to rest for the night and recharge our batteries. Good morning. I think one of the misconceptions of van life is that you wake up in places like this every morning and that's just not the truth. Last night we slept at a rest stop on the side of the highway, cars passing frequently. We slept at Walmarts, Home Depots, city streets. So we never take it for granted having a spot like this. It's amazing every single time. drove down from Breckenridge area. We are now in Crest, not Crested Butte, Buena Vista, Crested Butte. We're heading to uh, later this week. But a uh, cool little mountain town, tons of 14ers around. Probably won't do any of those, but uh, we're gonna spend the next couple nights here. So sometimes we just need an easy meal in the van, but we still want to get our veggies in. So this was a squash, zucchini, mushroom, onion, black bean quesadilla. So just kind of like a Southwestern quesadilla. So not the most healthy, not the most unhealthy. That's kind of how we try to balance our meals in the van.
What are you doing? I'm putting a latch so that my closet won't keep exploding on bumpy roads. <laughs> Colorado National Monument trying to break up our drive on the way to Grand Tetons and Yellowstone. Unexpected to see this in Colorado after being in the mountains all those times. Uh, we're gonna head to uh, somewhere in Utah tonight, I don't know, but uh, <laughs> to get closer to uh, some of Molly's friends and then head up to Grand Teton later this week. Big thanks to everyone who's followed our channel so far. Two videos ago, we got our first thousand view video. So it's really fun sharing our journey. Our only hope from these videos is just to inspire people to get out there and travel. We are just wanting to, to share our journey and if you have any questions or comments, uh, we'd love the conversation. So feel free to leave those in the comment box, but yeah, we're really excited to keep sharing these and love the feedback we've gotten so far.